today we are going to sorry about the racket it's my mother today we are going to organize this pantry stay tuned So this is after we took out everything. Completely empty. So now we're gonna take out the shelving. And what are we gonna do, Ma? Uh, paint, after taking out the shelving, we're gonna sweep the floor, we're gonna paint the walls. Mm -hmm. um, and then put the shelving back. Okay. So that's what we're gonna do right now. So we're gonna organize everything, put it into cute little boxes and bags and stuff. And yeah, and then this is the seasoning. This is flat paint. I'm just gonna paint it up. Simple white flat paint. I'm not crazy about flat paint. Okay, 
so while my mom is painting over there, I'm gonna start uh, washing out the containers that we got. So we got six of these jars, um, and we're gonna put different things in it. And then we got, we got all of these. These we're gonna be putting like different things also, like potatoes, um, fruit, um, and like other boxes that we can't get into the round containers. And we also got some of these to um, put like pasta and some other stuff. And I think that might be it. I think we do have some more stuff over here, but I'm gonna take everything out of the box and start showing you guys what it is. Okay, so this is everything that we got. We have six jars and we got all of these from Amazon. So we have six of them. We're gonna fill them with, uh, what are we filling it with again? Um, oatmeal. Sugar. Sugar, coffee, oatmeal, rice. sugar, coffee, rice. And pasta. And pasta. Yeah. There we go. So filling these up. And then we got this thing for some tea. So we're gonna put the tea in here, organize it. And then we got these four containers for cereal. They're 120 ounces each. So you can fit a lot of cereal in here. We got four of them. And then we got three of these cylinder containers for uh, pasta, Something else, rice, I think. No, pasta. I don't know, we have to think about it, but I know yeah. pasta definitely. Definitely pasta mm -hmm. and some other stuff. We don't know yet, but we're gonna figure that out. Um, and then we got these four beautiful, beautiful baskets that I love so much. Um, and they're open in the front, so you can put things in there, take them out easily. They're stackable and um, did we get four or we got six? We have like six, six. We got six of these, so. Excuse my hand, I was just painting, so I got paint all over my hand, but. So we got six of these. And then, these are just the tops for everything. I love these tops for the jars, they're so cute. Look at this, with the little, 
um, you know, I don't know what I'm saying, y'all. You know what I'm saying. Anyways, we got six of those. Six. Everything came out to about $200, I would say, um, all together. Remember, we got six of these and six jars, and so about $200. But I know at Ikea, you can get them for a bit cheaper. So if you are looking to get stuff like this but don't want to spend that much money, I would definitely check out Ikea for these things. Okay, back to the painting. Okay, so starting on the very top shelf, we have all of our cereals. We have an, actually a, an additional cereal box, but we just don't need it right now. So that's why you only see three. And then um, in this basket, we have our rice, our popcorn, some granola, um, and some baggies back there. And that's pretty much like our green section for the pantry. And then on the next shelf, we have some white, no, not white rice brown rice pasta lentil beans and the long pasta the spaghetti pasta and then we have a little thing of sugar this is going to actually go on the kitchen countertop but we're not we're not there yet so then we have our what is this pancake mix some cream of wheat um some extra cereal that is about to be eaten in like a day and then some corn mix and then on the next shelf, we have our flour, brown sugar. Um, we have our coffee right there, our oatmeal, and then our organic sugar in the back. And then right here in the front, we have all of our teas. And then we also have um, some hot chocolate, some Nesquik, so good. Some frosting, because we like cake in this house. Um, some peanut butter, some honey, and then my all-time favorite, oh, my all-time favorite almond butter. This stuff is so good. And then on the second to last shelf, we have all of our canned goods, pretty much. So all of our beans, um, we eat a lot of beans, as you can see. Um, tomato sauce, tuna. And then on this side, we have some breadcrumb. Uh, some pasta sauce, and then a couple of other, other canned stuff like soup and corn and whatnot. And then all the way down here on the bottom, this is actually going to be a fruit basket, which is why we only have a single avocado in here right now. But it's actually going to be like all of our fruits and vegetables that don't go in the fridge are going to go in this basket. And then over here, we have like plastic bags for the garbage and um, sandwich baggies, uh, coffee filter, and some foil. And that's everything for the pantry, for the shelving itself. And then over here, we have all of our seasonings, everything. I'm not going to take you guys through the seasonings, but um, it's just your typical seasonings, you know, everything you would normally use. And then all the way on the bottom, we actually have this really cool bag holder that my mom has actually had for maybe like 10 years at this point. 
um and it's pretty much just to literally hold bags you roll them up you stick them in there and then you pull them out right through this front part and yeah so that's the pantry it came out so good yay okay that's it for me thank you guys for watching if i actually post this video and if you do end up watching it thank you for watching um like comment and subscribe thank you bye